We're going to take the doors off of this vehicle to use on the uh, club cab. We're actually going to um, cut the doors. Uh, I don't know if I can show you where. We're going to cut the door here and we're going to cut the door down here um, out of two of our doors. And then we're going to take the back panel from in here somewhere up and around to here somewhere. And we're going to take this piece and weld it where we cut this piece out, making a square window or rectangle window, if you would, instead of the sloped for the two rear doors on the crew cab. We're gonna take the handles off. We'll shave them. We'll cut the front section off of this here, flip it over and weld it here where we've taken this off. We'll take the hinge column off of this door, put it on the back side of the club cab, which will allow us to make suicide doors on the club cab. And we'll probably have to grab the locking mechanism as well because they didn't come with one. I found a surprise inside of this truck, an extra grill. That grill will become a piece of wall art and in here, there's not much left of the dash, but we'll pull what's left of the dash and uh, make that available um, once we know what we do and don't need. There's a glove box, uh, a Speedo. I don't know if the, the switch is underneath the ashtray. They appear to be some aftermarket thing, but uh, we'll see. I do need the wipers. Um, and I can use the door panels as patterns. I can use some handles. Uh, so there's a few parts in here I can use. If not, uh, maybe there's something you can use. Um, I think the only piece of glass that's not broken on this is the rear window. And that's how we know that it's uh, a late 50s because of the size of it. The bed's actually in pretty good shape. Um, the fenders, of course, are a little messed up from sitting on the ground for all these years. And unfortunately, I don't have the Willie stamped tailgate but uh, those are easy enough to get. Uh, we'll do something else with that one, I think. So stay tuned. We're gonna start cutting this bad boy up and uh, see what we have left.